Hey everyone, Dan Blue here. I'm gonna show you how to make a barbell sleeve wrist roller. So, very, very simple. I've got a one of these 42 inch looped bands. Uh, used to be referred to as a jump stretch band. Anyway, this one's pretty thick. I've got a 25 pound plate and I've girth hitched it, which is just looping it inside of itself uh, through the plate. You could use a kettlebell, anything that works. I mean, dumbbells even work fine. So, from there, I'm gonna loop this over the end and I'm gonna double it over, just like that. And then I'm gonna center this up. Other th important thing to note, if you look at the end of this barbell here, I've got a 45 pound plate on it. That's just gonna be a counterweight because we don't have, wanna have a ton of weight here, especially if you're using a lot of weight to do this. We don't wanna have the barbell upend itself. So be very careful. Make sure you consider how much weight you're using here and counterweighting the bar. Obviously it doesn't have to be one-to-one -one because these bars are really long. It actually takes two and a half plates. So two 45s and a 25 on one end with nothing here for the bar to start to go over. Um, we figured that out over time but so just counterweight just to be safe and uh, so once you double it over we have this nice two inch uh, obviously Olympic sleeve and then we just have an, an immediate fat wrist roller just like that nice and smooth we can go both directions very very easy to use and again you could set this up in any commercial gym as long as you have a band or some kind of strap we don't really use the, the band so much here because I mean I have my full facility so what we typically do is we take a climbing webbing we have some pipes with a hole drilled in them and then we have that way we have permanent wrist rollers we're going to throw up really really easy but we'll use this if we're in a pinch or if you have climbing webbing which is really like kind of like one or two inch wide nylon webbing that you kind of think about like a seat belt you could have a loop of that as well and they're actually really cheap it's probably as cheap or cheaper than a band you get a nice long like climbing loop of that nylon webbing and then you always have it you can loop it you can loop it very durable won't stretch that's just a good alternative but again if your, your gym already has these or you already have these no need to go out and buy other stuff you know they will uh they'll bounce a little bit but not too much i mean you can see they'll let it down it'll, it'll sway a little bit but that's really not impacting the exercise and these bands are super durable so all right just a little tutorial on how to make a, a barbell sleeve wrist roller